he gets some sort of like you know air dodge read it's like maybe a knee or maybe like yeah like some sort of like smash attack or something like that Prophet's also really good about calling off uh, lower recoveries with uh, obviously Falcon's uh, up tilt mm -hmm. But it's going to be kind of hard to do that since Against Mewtwo. Mewtwo is going to be teleporting. Yeah, he snaps right to that ledge, so he's going to have to go for that. Uh, he's just going to have to have a, an all-around good neutral because offstage, with, between the air dodge and teleport, a well-placed back air or knees, like, I mean, that's a thing. It's going to be fun, though. It's going to be fun. I love watching Falcons, dude. Like, <laughs> Falcons, Falcons, Falcon is like, you know, like, if there was a tier list for how high your character was, Falcon be, yeah. Falcon's like S tier. S tier, a tier of his <laughs> own. It'd be Falcon tier. Falcon tier. It's you like, can't even get that high. No, no. <laughs> you can get maybe half that hype with, say, I don't know. Maybe Ganon. 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 But that's like. He's like a demigod. He's you know? yeah. He kind of goes into the whole disrespect. He's had his. He has his own bracket. <laughs> <laughs> so you got the God Falcon, the mm -hmm. demigod Ganon, and maybe like, maybe like a really good Zero Suit. I really like watching Zero Suits. Zero Suit is, and is also pretty fun to watch. But uh, I don't know. I'm a Fox fanboy mostly because uh, Zay and Jay Sun and. There's a DFW's got a lot of solid foxes. I just really like fox because like a lot of the stuff is like I guess quote unquote honest is what people call it a lot. It's like you have to put in a lot of time to like and learn all the combos and learn all these like different like percents and like learn all these like tech chasing options. You're right. Like every other week, uh, Zay hits me up, he's like, dude, check out these videos, check out these videos, and he's perfecting his combos. Alright, alright. That's, that's enough fanboying. <laughs> we the, are in, the slow walk. Mm-hmm. That intimidating. So we Such got, a hard read at like barely 15, 15 seconds into the he's, match. He's going for it. He's Just like, tell Prophet, you know, I have this option. Yeah. Don't neutral get up. <laughs> <laughs> the call out, like... More like the Oracle, because it nothing even happened for him to make that read. <laughs> yeah. Good shield on that uh disable. Okay. Baiting out the air yeah, dodge. Baiting I, it out. Hey. <laughs> it's a good call. Oh, yeah. I love then, freaking Falcon's grab. His dash grab is so good, especially at near ledge. I have to say it's probably one of the best in the game, aside from maybe like pits. Hit, I found out, has a really good grab. Yeah. Uh, Obelisk, uh, Dark Pit main. He uh, did not know this, and I learned. He schooled me. <laughs> Let's. Ooh. Shadow Balls. That's uh, another good thing. Zoning out uh, Captain Falcon. That's it. Yep. Up throw. Hmm. That was a pretty brave move. Bold, bold like risk. I mean, bold, um, bold statement, but yeah. not really that much of a risk since you were only at zero. Like, yeah. Here we go. Then, oh, see, there we go. Mew Square getting a little bit too greedy for that edge guard and yep. dying for it. But it's Which a... Prophet is amazing at exploiting you going off stage. Yes, he is. Prophet is he's like me he's like me squared. He's their goal is to get you off stage and combo you into a dare. They're kinda like watching two sides of the same coin. Exactly. <laughs> Good air dodge on that uh, up B. Then they're both getting these air dodge reads. Mm, it's pretty rad. To say the least, sorry, I'm at a loss for words in some of this. It's just it's so hype and they're moving faster than too much Falcon, man. <laughs> And then Mew Square being extra safe with that super high recovery on that upbeat. Yeah. Just making sure that he does not get too framed. He's not even put in a position where Falcon could most likely guess where he was going to be. Yeah, he's keeping track of Orphan's movements pretty well, making sure he's not putting himself in a compromising situation. Unfortunately, it's... you can't air dodge through two of those. Yeah. It's so fast you can throw out multiples really quick. Ledge Trump. 
I didn't take that into account. That's how you deal with it. And he waited until the very last second where it really counted to bring that out. Uh-huh. You don't use it all match, nobody expects it, and then bam. That's that's what we call conditioning. Yeah. Shampoo and conditioner. At its finest. <laughs> oh, uh because you were worth it too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because you're worth it. Game two, they're running it back. Was it Smashville last time or Town and City? It was. It was Town and City last time. Okay, so they're switching it up, going to Smashville. Really, this is this is Smashville? No, this is Town, Town and City. City Capital. I'm. So <laughs> it's been a long day. That's okay. Jab to jab. Dash attack. I love Mewtwo's up tilt. Good range, reaches through platforms. Has such good coverage as well. Like, good nice tech, tech on the stage spike. Ooh. Misspaced that F smash just a little bit. Ooh. The really awkward running footstool. <laughs> We've seen a lot of those tonight. Alright. Ooh, excellent Catching time, Shadow Bill. Yeah. Oh, went for the knee. You gotta go for it. Yeah, like once, right. it's, once it's Falcon all. style. Really just punishing all Prophet's landings now. That's yeah. how he's getting 93%. Just waiting for Prophet to land and then just punishing accordingly. That was a. That was a really random F smash. That was a, that was a call out, yeah. It was like, hey, guess what? What? <laughs> This F smash though. Those nares do so much like for Mewtwo's coverage. Excellent spacing tool, limiting the movement. Ooh. Trying to get that spot dog for you. Keeping up pressure with those single jabs. Yeah. Ooh. That was close. Air dodge? I think that's what Prophet's going for right now. Yeah. Air dodge bait. Just a Air dead. dodge bait. There we go. I Ooh. called it again. <laughs> see, this is why I play Shul. Yeah. You see. Know? Yeah. <laughs> I'm really feeling it. I am really feeling it. <laughs> All right. O2. O2. What was that? O2. Who won that one? Profit won that one. Profit. You just need. Okay. And then Me Squared won the first one, right? Yes. Okay. Should not be 0 2. Maybe that was from the last match, uh, but it's currently 1 1. Yeah, 1 1. Oh. That's the great thing about Falcon, is up B is like, he can go deep, he can go far. Good knee, sour spot, but good. Classic recovery nair. Prophet's looking for a good spot to throw it, anything out really to gain some momentum. Even just going all the way off stage and almost risking everything for that. But that was a, I mean, that was a close back air. Could have almost killed. It was. Getting really like good single jab. Yeah. B squared's got really good pressure. I don't pressure. think he intended to land on that platform, so that was a little bit awkward. But um I mean Then calling out the back that air. rising there. Yep. Which Mew Squared has been doing a lot. Like I called it out whenever he was fighting Denti as well. It's like it's all that was it, an interesting it's set like too. one of the go to options for Mew Squared, it seems. I mean, About it, I mean, four or five rolls in a row, that's interesting. <laughs> trying to condition the conditioning. <laughs> Air dodge bait! Air dodge bait! I would've gone oh, for the upbeat, bro. Yeah, it would've been close. I don't know if that would've killed, but it would've been really cool. <laughs> And everybody knows if you look cool while you're playing Falcon, you already won. Yeah, yeah. It's more. It's better than getting the uh, the the balloons. 
And speaking of looking cool, I'm ready for that air dodge beat. Just saying. Calling it now? <laughs> I'm calling it again. Ooh. Almost got... Ooh! Excellent side beat. Keeps on going for it. I think Mew Square just has caught on to... It's caught on to it. Barely holding on. Profit's what can he really... do? Prof has been really good about keeping the momentum going. <laughs> Maximizing his defensive plays while keeping the pressure on New Square, keeping him off stage, and finishing with the back air. Knowing that New 2 has like kind of a problem landing because he's kind of floaty, he knew that most likely New Square would go for aerials whenever trying to like contest it. So yeah. that's why he was going for bears, that's why he was going for knees, that's why he was going for air dodge baits, because he knows that Mew Squared most likely going to jump. Yep. And even if he had his other option like a nair, other option like most a nair, of, most of Falcon's disjoint could challenge that. Like, it's fantastic. It is. I mean, he's the king of flair for a reason. <laughs> the god tier of style. Yeah. Alright, so that puts us with... Hold on. That might have been 3-0. That was 3-0. I that might have miscalculated. That was a My bad. It so, was not 1-1 one one that time. It was 0-2. Was that the final? I think it was. Because they're that both... That was it? Looks like we're done. I'm so sad. It was so I much was fun I was expecting another hype game. I'm also <laughs> sad. Well, that's it. Profit wins. 3 is mu squared. Really That's... solid games by both players. Yeah. No, uh, Prophet, he was really good with that pressure. I mean, you play Falcon, you play fast, you play hard. And like, it was phenomenal. Pushed, uh, had the pressure all the way to off stage, and he kept him off stage. He, the Mew Square did give him a run for his money, like, uh, challenging him off stage. Constantly adapting the stuff that um, Prophet was throwing out. As calling well. out, calling out a lot of bad, uh, bad moves with a like down smash. But yeah. I have to say, Prophet has gotten so many upsets in this tournament. He beat, he beat New Square. He beat Irologi. He beat all these other different people. I'm pretty sure that he beat Irologi. I'm pretty sure. Zay yeah. said it earlier, but. Yeah. He has beaten a lot of really good players. Definitely a hidden boss. Um, I know he was... Uh, he, uh, he didn't perform this well last week, but I'm sure like, he went back and thought it and like, re-watched it and learned some things, but uh, he was just... He was on point tonight. He played like Apex like Captain Falcon, and I'm looking forward to him coming back and you know, showing us his moves. I've been wanting that. I've been wanting to throw that pun in there the entire time. <laughs> it was pretty great. Anyway, well, I gotta show you out. That was a terrible pun. <laughs> anyway, I caught. I appreciated that. <laughs> um, I guess we'll see you at the next tournament. Next tournament. Thank you for watching Redline tournaments at Source Gaming. Goodbye. See you guys. <laughs>